Hello everybody, this is Charles and I'm back with another Choco King review, this time for the Soul of Choco King GX23 Zambot 3. Alright, without further ado, let's begin. First, uh, let's look at Zambot Ace. Um, it's a jet, simple jet, um, nice detailing to the cockpits. You can actually open up and see there's um, two pilots, a purple doggy and a pink pilot. Um, very very neat, uh, comes with a lot of accessories but I'm not going to show them this time around first I'm just going to transform Zambot um, let me take out this chest portion fit it in with a smaller one alright and then you're going to just fold the legs down push it, pull it out arms out fist out pull out the arms pull out the head and there you have Zembo Ace. Um, very neat uh, articulation, I would say. Uh, full arm rotation, and he's he can even move his shoulder forward. So if you want to do a pose with him holding his gun together with both hands, you can actually do it. I'm not showing it this time round either. Um, legs wise, um, pretty good motion from back, knees. Um, good enough for you to have uh, quite a lot of poses. So I would say Zambot Ace by himself is pretty cool a figure. Let me just put him aside right now. And we have a uh, Zambo tank. Uh, pretty neat drills. Can actually turn a little. You can have hands that similar to can rubber rollers. Okay, chunky piece of metal. And we have the giant jet here. Uh, very hefty, very nice, uh, cool landing gear, you can actually put it in. So without further ado, let's get to the transformation process. Uh, what I want to do first is to pull the legs apart, yeah, likewise, take out this piece which will be used later, and like to uh, just flip the legs up, flip the feet up, close it, and you would like to push these things upwards, the wings. And there you have it. You're going to put these two ninja stars into the kneecap. And there you have it, the leg assembly is done. Now we're going to chest. Um, to the main body wise, what you're going to do first, you got to pull out this um, two drills. Then you got to pull out this wheels at the back. And then what we're gonna do is just gonna turn the chest compartment, push the back, lock it in place, pull the arms out, oops, pull the arms out, very neat articulation. Okay, and next what we're gonna do, you're gonna peg it together here. Close the copy area and you're gonna go to the back and you're gonna pack this part as well. And there we have assembly the main body portion. Zambot Ace. What you're gonna do, just gonna pull out this small chest piece first. I'm gonna do keep the arms in, keep the legs in, legs pointed down. We're gonna do right now is to pull the chest down, just like open it up, pull it down so that the head will show. All right. Okay. Okay, better be careful here. Yeah. And then I'm gonna push a little zambo head in. Flip this out. Okay, and we're more or less done now. Slot this whole piece in to the chest compartment close these two tabs and we are done for Zambot so I'm gonna put this giant chest piece in and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna remove this um, crest as well this is actually one that you can use for perfect transformation so I'm gonna keep this exploded and put in the piece that actually came with Zambot to make a bigger crest this looks a lot nicer there we have it over here, I'm not forgetting the backpack. What I'm gonna do for this 
slot this to the back. Um, gonna slot this to the back. Gonna fit this in like so. Yep. And there we have it. Zambo Ace. Zambot 3, sorry. Zambot Ace. Fully transformed. It's very easy to actually transform this piece out. I think uh, it's a very nice piece. Uh, full range of arm motion. Very good articulation for the arms. Legs wise, um, pretty limited, but uh, I would say it's, it doesn't really affect the overall look of Zambot. It comes with a lot of weapons as well, uh, a lot of fists that you can interchange with. Note what these are, these, uh, these two fists, um, fully articulated finger joints. These are very, very interesting. And, um, well, I would say this, this, is, this piece is really, really, very nice piece and I'm doing a review for it now in anticipation of what's coming up, uh, GX53, Titan 3. Both of them are going to complement each other very well and I, and I know that Titan 3 is going to be as tall as Zambot 3. Uh, in case that some of you might not know, Zambot actually represents the moon and Titan 3 represents the sun, so it's like a moon and sun attack. So it's really, really a great piece. Some size comparison uh, with Combatler V, as you can tell. Um, almost the same in terms of height, Zambot being higher, but in terms of weight, Zambot is a lot heavier than Combatler V. Um, this is a really, really great piece to own. Um, for those of you who haven't got it, do get it and do look out for GX53 Titan 3 as well. Once I get my hands on it, I'm going to do a review on it as well. So here's my little review for Zambot 3. Hope you like it and catch you for more Chococking reviews next time. Hello everybody, this is Charles and I'm back with another Chococking review. This time for the Soul Chococking GX23 Zambot 3. Alright, without further ado, let's begin. First, uh, let's look at Zambot Ace. Um, it's a jet, simple jet. Um, nice detailing to the cockpits. You can actually open up and see there's um, two pilots a purple doggy and a pink pilot. Um, very, very neat. Uh, comes with a lot of accessories, but I'm not going to show them this time around. First, I'm just going to transform Zambot. Um, let me take out this chest portion, fit it in with a smaller one. Alright. And then you're gonna just fold the legs down, push it, pull it out, arms out, fist out, pull out the arms, pull out the head, and there you have Zambo Ace. Um, very neat. Uh, Alright, here, yeah, likewise, take out this piece which will be used later. And like to uh, just flip the legs up, flip the feet up, close it, and you would like to push these things upwards, the wings, and there you have it. You're gonna put these two ninja stars into the kneecap, and there you have it. The leg assembly is done. Now we're going to chest, um, to the main body wise. What you're gonna do first? Gotta pull out this um, two drills. Then you gotta pull out this wheels at the back. And then what I'm gonna do is just gonna turn the chest compartment, push the back, lock it in place, pull the arms out, oops, pull the arms out, very neat articulation. Okay, and next what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna peg it together here, close the copy area, and you're gonna go to the back, and you're gonna peg this part as well. And there we have assembly, the main body portion, Zambo Ace. What you're gonna do, just gonna pull out this small chest piece first. I'm gonna do keep the arms in. Keep the legs in, legs pointed down. What we're gonna do right now is to pull the chest down, just like open it up, pull it down so that the head will show. Alright, okay, okay, better be careful here. Yeah, and I'm gonna push a little Zambo head in 
flip this out okay and we're more or less done now slot this whole piece in to the chest compartment articulation I would say uh, full arm rotation and he's he can even move his shoulder forward so if you want to do a pose with him holding his gun together with both hands you can actually do it I'm um, not showing this time now either um, legs wise um, pretty good motion front and back knees um, good enough for you to have uh, quite a lot of poses so I would say Zenbot Ace by himself is pretty cool a figure let me just put him aside right now and we have a uh, Zambo tank um, pretty neat drills actually turn a little you can have hands that simulate a can rubber rollers okay chunky piece of metal and we have the giant jet here uh, very hefty very nice uh, cool landing gear you can actually put it in so Without further ado, let's get to the transformation process. Uh, what I want to do first is to pull the legs apart. Close these two tabs, and we are done for Zambot. So I'm going to put this giant chest piece in. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to remove this um, crest as well. This is actually one that you can use for perfect transformation. So I'm going to keep this. Exploded and put in the piece that actually came with the bot to make a bigger crest. This looks a lot nicer. And there we have it. Oh, yeah, not forgetting the backpack. What I'm gonna do for this slot this to the back. i um, gonna slot this to the back. I'm gonna fit this in like so. Yep. And there we have it, Zambo Ace, Zambot 3, sorry, Zambot Ace, fully transformed. It's very easy to actually transform this piece, I would think uh, it's a very nice piece, uh, full range of arm motion, very good articulation for the arms. 